Oke. Okay. Baca dia. Wow. I guess I'm fine to live, but it's beginning to be so exhausting now. So, the commonality of society in the world that we, in which all, we all live in. Of course, expect other people to do the same norm, because that's really how they how they really see the, themselves. So, kind of the question remains is like, really, why should I even remain on this earth? Because. If it's nothing that brings me the greatest joy or even puts a smile on my face that fire within my soul that excitement to the point where I wouldn't be feeling like this or I'm acting like my inner child I at least would be so fulfilled. It has nothing to do with that. It has nothing to do with what I love to do. All the things that I love, all the things I enjoy, all the things that bring me joy, if it doesn't involve that, I'm not doing it. Like, seriously, why? It's really like forcing yourself, of course, to live. And really for other people. Just because they don't see you in the same light that you want to see yourself. That's the world and the environment I pretty much live in right now. So it's really hard to be present when all of your present involves commonality, the commonality of society now. Why honestly would they change? But it would spark one. But, but. One would spark the entire mind, yeah. You're right. But how long will it change? How long will it change? And how long until we can finally be happy About who you truly are. Even if it's weird, geeky, and but what do I know? I'm just pretty much dead nobody with a disability, of course. And yes, it's fucking real. If you've never been in my life, don't fucking comment ever in your life. Anyways. I guess that's all I gotta say for now. It's just... the commonality of society in the world that which we all live in, including, of course, myself, which I am forced to live right now. Even at 30 years old, I am still, 
I still have this freaking fear.